Welcome to the last day of our 10 days whole body wellness project. Today is the first day, right? right? First of all, we're outside. And secondly, I am excited to be bringing this last session, which is a full body yoga stretch. And we're going to be doing most of it standing. This session is going to help you uh, increase circulation all over your body, energize you, relieve any tightness or tension in any part of your body. And also, it's still going to be very simple, but you know, be ready to move your body. All right. So we're going to get started at the top of the mat or rug or whatever it is you're standing on. Okay. So you're going to stand with your hips and your legs slightly apart. But you're going to be standing straight, no slouching. Okay. All right. So bring your hand to center you just for a minute or so. Just breathe and calm your breath down. Okay. It's always proper to get your breath under control before you start moving. All right, that's enough of breathing. So bring your hands out to the side and lift your hands up above your head and let your palms down. And as you exhale, bring your palms to the floor. Gradually, if it doesn't touch, bend your knees and bring the palms down to the mat. Okay? Now as you breathe in, you lift and you bring it like you're sitting in a chair. Try to bring your hands by your ears or even behind it. Breathe here. Seems hard, but just breathe, okay? And as you exhale, same thing, bring your hands down, bend your knees, and we're going to straighten our legs and go into a plank. We're just going to hold it for like 10 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. So hold your body and bring it down and lay down on top of your toes, and then lift your chest up, and back. Inhale and exhale. Bring your body up with your hands. Now you tuck your toes under. Lift your legs up and see if you can gradually bring your heels down. If you don't have flexibility to do this, you can bend your knees and try to bring your legs to your chest. Okay? Inhale and exhale. Now we're going to bring your left leg forward, flatten this one this way, bend your knees and then lift up, As exhale, face this way, straighten your arms to the side and then we're going to do a reverse, just curve your body to the right, and then bring it forward, hands up, and as you exhale, bring your hands down, hold this leg, bring this back and then we'll do the other side, okay, down, up, exhale to the side, and then reverse. Side, bend. As you exhale, you bring your palms back down, back into downward facing dog. Okay, now you walk, you will walk through the top of the mat. Lift your hands up and down. Okay. Then next now, put your hands to your waist. And we're going to do a little bit of uh, lunges. So lift your right leg, bring it back, and then bring your knees. Gradually, you want to feel a little pinch on your thighs, and bring it down. And then, we're going to rock forward and back. Just a little shake. Rock back, forward, and back. And when you're ready, this is the balancing act, so a little stability is needed. Now you lift your right knee up, and bring it back. Join the left, and we'll do the same thing on the left now. So you lift your left leg, bring it back, and then slowly bring your knees down, and then do rock back, front and back. Okay. Okay. Now lift again up, and bring your legs down. Lift your hands up. We are going to fold forward again. Down. Bend your knees. Bring your hands up in a chair pose again. And as you exhale, straighten your legs. Bring your hands down. Or bring it to your chest. And 
Oof, that was short but very effective. So when people hear about yoga, it's not always supposed to be very complicated. It's just involved trying to move your body, uh, you know, trying to get the movements to reach all parts of your body. And um, this was short, very effective. So this brings this then this challenge to a close. I am both happy and sad at the same time. I just want to say thank you guys so much for joining us on this 10 day challenge. It has been such a joy to be able to bring you simple routines that you can infuse you know, into your day to day activities, your day to day routines. Seriously guys, this year create a system and a routine around your own goal. That will be what will make it easy for you to hit all of your goals inclusive of your health goals. And that's why I am recommending that you take this 10 day challenge again and again and again. Why? It goes round your body from your neck to your shoulders to your upper body to your hands and your wrists to your hips down to you know having your fitting exercises and yoga exercises we really ran through everything did we and that's why it's so important that you add this you know to your everyday routine i hope that you really enjoyed all that we brought to you and please stick around with us this year for more amazing content we are very much particular about you hitting your goals so cheers to hitting all of your 20 Bye!